going to be online. Stop. Here with head coach Scott Laverty, winning pitcher, or winning pitcher Wyatt Thompson, and losing pitcher Dylan Holtz, and his dog. <laughs> uh, coach, uh, we'll start with you opening the like, statement on the game, and yeah. your thoughts on getting by on that one, 3-1 win. Yeah, well, I mean... Wyatt here. I mean, just the job that he did, especially after the the tough time that uh, that they gave him in the conference uh, tournament last weekend uh, to come back and and just dominate the way he did. Just really showed the, the guts and, and what he's done all year. You know, that was uh, uh, that that game last weekend was an aberration, and he proved this. You know, today that uh, he is the conference pitcher of the year and and uh, and going to help move us on hopefully. And uh, obviously, the pitching came through for you in, in a big spot when you needed to get through and stay in the winners bracket. You got some timely hits early on, but you guys did leave uh, a lot of runners on base. How do you move forward with the situational hitting and, and trying to get a few more cricket numbers? On yeah, I mean, absolutely. I mean, the, the one thing that the, each of these two games show against Pacific and uh, against Pomona in this one um, is pitching and defense wins um, championships. Um, and um, so if we if we dial in our situational hitting just a little bit more uh, and and take care of some some business that way, um, you know, that, that might be a four or five or six one game. Um, and so that's the that's the positive thing. But championships are won by pitching and defense and, and, and especially against a team like Pomona who can just they just have had a fantastic season, um, and they can really hit. Uh, and what the, what these guys did against them today was 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 fa uh, fantastic. Um, and so, but it's pitching and defense. So if we lo as long as we continue to pitch and play defense, and, and just we just got to score one more than they do. Why I coached you earlier, but obviously, I think you I'm sure you want to forget a couple from last week and get the same. <coughs> Yeah, no, that's that's one that you don't. I don't want to forget. You know, I, I live off that stuff, and and I wanted to pitch. I wanted to face them again, and you know, just you know, knowing that I had my defense behind me the whole game, uh, getting out of big situations all game, it was just. I mean, it was a great great feeling. A week a week ago today, I thought that our season could have ended because of me, and now today, sitting here after throwing seven innings, no runs, is I mean, the best feeling in the world. Yeah, thrilled. It really, <clears throat> it didn't change at all, actually. Uh, you know, I think I just had an off day last week. Uh, bullpen going into this week, uh, my pitching coach and I talked about it. He said, just be yourself, be yourself out there. And that's what I focused on. I mean, I'm, I was working with my fastball and getting getting ahead with my changeup and all my stuff was working today and that's, that's what's gonna do it. I mean, it's just, it was, I'm glad to have my defense behind my back and and then them to put up a few runs for me. Uh, but yeah, I mean, the, the approach didn't really change. Yeah. It, it took you a few dozen pitches to get that first out last week, and you got it in two pitches. <laughs> <laughs> right, so how, uh, did you feel that first out like, all right, like and I'm, I'm locked in, I'm settled in? Yeah, I mean, <clears throat> that's, that was a big focus going into this game, actually, was was first, I mean, it always is all season, get that first that first batter. And, and you know, getting that first batter today just gave me the confidence to to just to just trust everyone behind me, trust my defense, and and it was huge. Yeah, that, that set the precedence the whole game. And, and Dylan, you got came in locked down on the ninth there. Um, you know, what's take us to the closer role, knowing that you know Wyatt's throwing a, a great game, and, and Corbin kind of was the bridge to you. So what, what was your mentality coming into the game and trying to close that one out? I mean, it, it's the same as always. Come in, throw as hard as I can, and try to get three outs. Like he did such an unbelievable job today. It was. It, awesome seeing him after last week coming back us getting the bid coming back and then just dominating today but the, the mindset like White's like White said never changes it's the same thing every time that's what's made it made us successful and why, why we're in this position the middle of that lineup seems so difficult to handle with Lowe and Kim and Pedrosian and all those guys back to back you guys kind of seem to handle them pretty well today what do you think was the key to, to really getting through that lineup that's proven that it can really turn on the power at any moment yeah, just executing our pitches. Uh, that's all it comes down to. Our pitching coach always has a good game plan going in, and as long as we execute, we're confident that we're going to get get the outs and, and get get a win in any situation. It's, uh, two games and two saves for you. Uh, are you going to go for the for the clean, clean sweep? I I hope so. <laughs> ready ready to go for Sunday and, and start that dog fight. Absolutely. All right. all right, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you so much. Yeah.